This is a similar technique that you just saw, and what we're doing is we're treating the patient's vertebrae, which is rotated that way. So you name the rotation by where the body or the front of the vertebrae is, so she is rotated to the right. So this is a technique for right rotated L4 that is stuck in uh, extension. So you palpate the segment that you want to mobilize, you slump the patient to that segment, good. Now the right facets are already closed, so you'll create a transitional side gliding to open those facets. Then you'll maximally take up the rotation that's available. Good. The patient will pull their right shoulder backwards gently for five seconds. Release. Relax for five seconds. We're going to slump more to get a little more flexion. Another translation to open up that vertebrae more and increase the rotation. Now again, the patient will actively rotate back with the right shoulder and relax. And the process is repeated three to five times. A flexion, a side gliding to the right to open up the facets. And now we're getting even more rotation to help return that to neutral alignment. And relax. Now, to follow that up, a functional technique, if that didn't work or if you have a patient that's in a lot of pain, a really nice gentle technique is called a functional technique. And that's where you place the patient in, at the desired segment where you want to move her and then she's passively just letting you move her. So you get a combination of flexion, extension, side bending, and rotation, and you basically allow the body to unwind and to return to neutral alignment. It's a place where it wants to go, and a lot of times if you'll give it a little direction, it'll just mobilize itself, and the tight muscles will relax and become stretched, and the shortened muscles, the, uh, excuse me, the long muscles that are weaker will be placed more in a shortened position.